Hi, this is Phil Grabo with Element Tuning, and as you can see, it is very cold here on the East Coast, snowy. Uh, we've got our 2013 FRS here that we are going to test a cold start in the Hydra EMS. It's a totally stock vehicle with um, just the Hydra EMS in it right now. We're doing a little testing, and being on the East Coast, uh, we have to deal with extreme temperature changes. So. Right now, as you can see, it's about negative two degrees Celsius, uh, coolant temp. Uh, I think that's about I don't know, 15 degrees or so Fahrenheit. And we also have to deal with 100 degree weather. So, you know, when you're deciding to, to purchase a standalone ECU, it's more than just, you know, a feature set. It's more than just the price. It's about the mapping and who you're buying it from and the level of detail that mapping gets. So if it's a California-based company where it rarely gets below 40 degrees, uh, barely gets above 80 degrees. Um, you've got a narrow window of tuning there, where here on the East Coast, we've got it all. So let's give this a shot. Let's see if it starts. And I'm pretty happy with that. So for our base maps, um, looks like we get a nice cold start on the uh, FRS BRZ FT86 on the Hydra 2.7 Nemesis software. And there it is. Sorry about the glare. Um, just goes to show, you know, it's nice to have good mapping all year round. That way when you purchase the product, um, you get an OEM-like driving experience. Thanks a lot and stay tuned for more tuning tips on the Hydra EMS.